photo of you before I forget. <laughs> ah, there you go. Oh, look at this. <laughs> It's uh, hardly champagne, is it? But I guess it'll do. Go on, top it up. Ah, to the new world champion, the greatest fighter that I've ever had the pleasure of knowing. To an even greater coach. Mm. Oh, must be a tight delicacy. Tough bastard, they weren't he? Ah, fuck me, they always are over here. I mean, it's a matter of life or death to them, isn't it? Still, the best man always wins. True. You know, I couldn't have done it without you. It's been one hell of a journey. That it has, my friend. Things only get better from here. Speaking of which, time to get paid. Oh, my friend, very entertaining. Yes, yes. That for you. What the fuck is this? What's going on? This? This is your money. This was supposed to be £50,000. I think you are mistaken, my friend. What the fuck's going on? How much is it? 50000 Thai bar. What do you expect me to do with that? You son of a bitch. This won't even cover the cost of our flights and hotel out here. My friend, if you do not want the money, I can always telephone to the bank and ask them to put a stop on, yes? Listen, my friend, I would be very careful if I were you. There are people here who would kill for less than that. And you, you just beat their champion. Have a nice holiday. Fucking mug! What am I gonna do now? I was relying on that money. Who is it? Hey, baby. Hey, what happened? Are you okay? Yeah, don't worry, I'm fine, I won. How did the scan go? Oh, thank God. I've been so worried. Let's just say we've been needing that win money more than we thought. What do you mean? We're having twins! Oh. Alright, fuck. You don't sound too excited. No, I am. It's, it, it's just a lot to take in, that's all. Listen, I've, I've got to go. I'll call you after the flight when we get when we fly home. All right? Okay then. I love you. Yeah, you too. Oh fuck! Look, man, I can get us a fight over in the Netherlands. They're paying pretty well at the moment, and that'll make back some of what we've lost. It'll take months to set up. I've already used all the money I had to get us here. I need that fucking money now. Oh, guess who's first? I bet first. Oh, thanks. Don't usually see Westerners in this part of town. I'll get these. What are you having? Well, that's very good of you. Uh, just a couple of beans, then. Sam Buga. Leon. Aaron. This here's Damien. Should we sit down? Yeah, why not? So, oh. business or pleasure? What brings you to Thailand? Oh, I see. <laughs> Damien here has just won a big title fight. Oh, no shit. I'll toast to that. Cheers, mate. So how about you? Pleasure, I'll take it. Actually, I run an import-export business out of here. How's that working out for you? Well, let's just say I don't go hungry. Take care, I'll celebrate tonight, then. Yeah, that's one word for it. There's something a little extra for you. My treat. Import and export, you say? Yep. Import and export. Listen, I couldn't help but overhear you at the bar talking about your money problems. But mate, we appreciate the beers, but we didn't need your charity. I'm not talking about the beers. I can help you with your problem. Think of it as a mutually beneficial transaction. You're not the first foreigner to be conned out of money for a fight. How bad was it? 
£50,000. What if I told you I can fully compensate you for that? How? Oh. You take some packages back to the UK for me. I'll have my contact waiting on arrival. Packages of what? Don't ask silly questions and don't get silly answers. Nah, forget it, man. We're not interested. Aaron. Yeah, Damien's right. We're not interested. You take the packages and you get paid. Simple. You change your mind. Talk about hiding in plain sight. <laughs> oh, only in Thailand. What did you take that for? Well, I was just humouring the guy. I mean, he did give us this. That's your line? No. You go and enjoy yourself. I don't know how you've got the energy to be doing what you're doing. I've got the hangover from hell over here. Guess not everyone's made a world championship material. Oh. <laughs> I was wondering when you were going to bring that up. <laughs> Next, you'll be having me spit shine your new belt. If you're free. And that belt's just going to be a reminder of how I got fucked over and what a wasted journey this has been, man. You weren't the only man to get fucked over. I mean, 20% of practically nothing isn't exactly what I signed up for either. When's this going to end? I'm fucking sick and tired of putting my life on the line for next to nothing. This, this was supposed to be my big break. And yet again, I've been mugged off. I don't know if I can do this anymore. How am I supposed to support a family like this? We don't have houses, you got it. At least we don't work for some rich suit. I don't know. Working with some rich suit doesn't sound too bad right now. Company car, guaranteed monthly income, whole nine till five gig. Oh, fuck off. Men like us, we ain't meant for that kind of thing. Just suck up this shit and move on to the next fight. Get yourself some coaching work on the side. Yeah, I like what I done. Oh, look at me. I turned out just fine. I wouldn't call being divorced and living in a rented bed at your age getting by just fine. But what's that supposed to mean? Well, your own kids don't even want anything to do with you. It's not a future I see for myself. Look, if you want to quit and throw away your talent just because you've got some little slut knocked up, then be my guest. But don't you fucking dare! bring my shit into your shit. I only came over here to support you, and this is how you thank me? Bullshit. I saw your face when the Russian shortchanged us. You've come out here for your cut of the fucking money, and that's it. If you'd have been a bit more savvy and got a proper contract drawn up, we wouldn't be in this situation in the fucking first place. Oh, fuck you! Aaron. Hey, baby. I don't really know. What do you mean? Look, there's something I need to tell you. You're scaring me now. Just tell me. It's about the money. There isn't going to be any. I don't understand. You, you said you won the fight. I did. But the promoter pulled a fast one on us. Look, I'm so sorry. I know what that money meant for our future, for our baby. Babies? Yeah, babies. Jesus, Damien. Why didn't you tell me sooner? I could tell something was wrong with you on the phone. What are we going to do now? I know. I can't stop thinking about it. I've decided I'm going to retire from fighting. I'm going to get a normal job and support this family properly. Finally? I've been telling you to get a real job for how many years now? I know. I'm sorry. 
sorry. We can always make more money, Damien. Just come home safe to me now. We'll find a way to fix this. We always do. Thanks, baby. I'll see you tomorrow. I love you. I love you too. Oh, finally. I was going to think you'd gone without me. You can't get rid of me that easily. Still, I'm sorry for what I said, yeah? It's all forgotten about. Don't worry. What are they for? Well, I thought we could do with some bigger suitcases, you know, to fit in all your touristy junk that you've been buying since we've been here. It's not a bad idea, actually. I thought I was going to have to leave some of this stuff behind. So where's breakfast? Breakfast? The breakfast you went out for? Oh, uh, well, I, I must have left it in the store while I was buying these. Um, never mind. How about we pack up and uh, I'll call a cab for the airport. We're running out of time. Oh, this is for Nice silk chairs. Thanks. Let's get a quick drink before the flight. I think you better come with us. Can I ask what this is about? The suitcases. Where are they from? We're not talking to you until we've got a lawyer. What? Why would we need a lawyer for? Tell her where you got them from. I can't remember the name of the store. What in them? T-shirt, shorts, just some clothes. What else? Jumper. What else? Ah, oh, I've got my world championship fight belt in there. He must have set the metal detector off. Sorry, I forgot. Open them. Yes, well, uh, if you finish with us, we'll uh, just pack up and uh, we must get on a flight home. I'm going to ask you one more time. I can't help you anymore after this. Where did you get the suitcases from? Okay. Breakfast. Went out for breakfast, did you? Damien, I'm sorry. Don't fucking talk to me, you piece of I'll shit. I'll deal with you later. Get the suitcases. Side this. I can't even read any of this. If you don't cooperate, thing could be really harsh for you. I had nothing to do with any of this. I hadn't even seen the suitcases before this morning. One of the suitcases was yours? Yes? Yeah, it had my stuff in it, but it, it wasn't my suitcase. But it has your stuff in it, yes? <sighs> yes. Research 
both suitcases and have confiscated a total of six pounds of cocaine. Do you realize the seriousness of drug smuggling in Thailand? Your friend had already signed the paper. I suggest you do the same. That's bullshit. You know those drugs weren't mine. You know exactly what's happened here. So, you refuse to sign it. Last chance. Okay. Wait. What's going to happen to my friend now? He signed the paper. He will be executed at dawn. What about me? I, I just want to go home to my family. You never going home. You better hope you are as good as fighting as you think you are. Keep up.